We're here today to launch the start of the development of our aeromedical precinct at Brisbane Airport. From Royal Flying Doctor Service, Life Flight, Queensland Retrieval Services, which is part of Queensland Health, and Queensland Police and their air wing service. I'm very excited about this aeromedical facility. It is going to make such a difference to patients. They're not going to be sitting on the hot tarmac in the middle of summer or in the pouring rain in, on a cold winter's day. They're going to be brought into the air conditioning in the patient facility. We can do the medical handover. They can safely be transferred to where they need specialist care. Same time, the crew gets ready to take that plane back out west out into the regions, bring in another patient, and we can do that much more efficiently and effectively, and it's going to be a much smoother operation for both the patients and the RFDS crew. Queensland leads the world in aeromedical capability. Nowhere else in the world delivers what the Royal Flying Doctor Service, Life Flight and Queensland Health do together here in Queensland. People come from around the world to see how to deliver aeromedical capability like Queensland does. And we will build on that strength with this new aeromedical hub here at Brisbane Airport, which starts construction today. This is great news for Queensland. It brings all the medical and emergency services together at one place at Brisbane Airport, and Brisbane Airport is the hub for those activities in the state. The aeromedical precinct is located between the two runways. That makes it very, very easy to depart and arrive at the airport and move people quickly to other modes of transport, such as ambulances and the like. Today, it was great to see the support from so many different parts of government, including the Premier and the Minister for Health, who have sponsored this development right from the beginning to ensure that we get the best possible outcome for Queensland. The base here really it becomes a central focal point where uh, the network all comes together. So Life Flight plays uh, a crucial part in the network, but we are only one piece of that part. So uh, with the RFDS uh, and their fixed wing aircraft and RSQ coordinating, and of course um, QAS and the paramedic service operate across all of the assets. So we already have a, an enormous amount of interplay to keep the network going and bringing us all under the one roof uh, I think can only be uh, great for coordination and for the standard of care that Queenslanders can expect.